Hi, welcome to Eight Words in On this video, we have one to discuss an anime figure for unboxing. We have here Nanami from Good Smart Company, Pop Up Parade Figure Series. The box looks quite nice. We're digging the yellow. We will also compare this with the band Presto and the Taiko Nanami after the unboxing. Aha, right, let's unbox. Open the lid, pick out the blister pack, cut the tapes, pick out the stand, remove the plastic. To get Nanami, remove the plastic pouch. Ooh, a bit scratch on the base. And that's Nanami to the stand. Three pegs. Here we have Nanami from Good Smile Company Pop Up Poi Figure Series. We will also be comparing with Bam Presto and Taito Nanami. The Pop Up Poi looks quite small next to the two prize figures, and there's the only one that's not holding a weapon. Let's start with the head. Nice flow of hair. See some stem line. Got the green lens on the goggles. Some neutral face. Nice flow of hair on the fringe. Onto the back. Some nice flow of hair. I think it's much better than the front. But in comparison to the other prize figure, I think Bam Presto actually has a nicer finish, whereas Pop Up Poi has a quite a smooth finish on the back. Plain light grey suit and brown shoes. Onto the hands, holding a tie, real nice finish on the hand fingers and the buttons on the side and the blue shirt. In comparison with the prize figures, it's similar opposed to the Taiko Nanami, where the pattern and finish on the tie matches more with the band Presto, which I think is a much nicer finish. And the band Presto one has a real nice movement in the tie as well. The other two also have their shirt, has their jacket unbuttoned. Onto the front of the pop-up parade, got the buttons, and grey pants and some really shiny brown shoes on the yellow base. Don't mind this scratch defect. One big element that's missing from this figure is the weapon and from the back you can see how static the pop-up parade feels without it. Taiko probably has the nice space with the effect on it. You can display them together but the pop-up parade Nanami feels really small next to the other two prize figures. I'm going to bring in all my Gojo figures for comparison with the Nanami pop-up parade. As you can see, a big variety of sizes. Some look giant next to Nanami and a big variety of prices as well. Let's up, Sega SPM. Man, Gojo is massive. Taiko, yeah, big clash with the base and size. The band presto Junko no Kaka, actually a really good fit. It is the TV series version as well. The band presto Juha no Jutsu, yeah, we're different scale and the spaces clash a lot as well. And here it is, pop up parade with pop up parade. Matches perfectly, it's really well together. Definitely get the same one together, that's a perfect match. And here are my Jujutsu Kaisen pop up parade collectors so far. Looking quite nice together. If you have been finding this video useful, please give it a like. I was able to get the stand we place. Big thanks to Anime Kaka for the excellent support. And here we have Nanami Pop Up Parade. Nice finish on the details, but it's missing its weapon and it's very static. So this is more a browse for now. If you'd like to see more Jujutsu Kaisen unboxing, please do it over here. <laughs> Bye!